Cities are now 50% of the population globally, and they will rise to 70% by 2050. That means we're going to build cities for three and a half billion people. If we don't get that right, I don't think we can succeed economically, socially, or environmentally. The first thing we need to do is shape cities in ways that reduce our urban footprint, to reduce our carbon needs. There's lots of empty land, there's lots of space in the street. We just need to rethink it and rebuild it. We are swimming in data and it's growing at phenomenal rates. The challenge is to translate this onslaught into useful information. Urban Footprint's a tool that allows you to layer different types of data and ask questions. You can create alternatives, and then measure the impacts of the alternatives. Really, SimCity for real. Our work has not just been in the United States, but also in places like China to develop universal principles of what good urban design is, what sustainable urban design is. It can reduce our carbon emissions, it can create healthier environments, it can create a more connected society.